Let's do this shit. Hey, what's going on, man? It's me, Duke. What's happening, man? I'm here covering for Mark here at the Nerd uh, Bar, or whatever you call this place. Uh, he had some stuff to do, so uh, he had me come in here and help him out. So, welcome, everybody. I got my instructions here. Uh, Mark told me to tell you that he did not receive a package he was waiting on, so that's why there was no Funko Pop Friday video. Um, that's actually where he's at right now. He went to go beat up the mailman, but I think the mailman's a male lady, so <laughs> he should win. Anyway, so um, today what we're going to do here is we're going to show off a couple of things that Mark picked up, some uh, things that I picked up, <laughs> and then we're going to do a 700 subscriber giveaway. So uh, that's pretty cool. Okay, all right. Let's get started. A couple of things that uh, Mark picked up here. You got them written down here because I'm not really sure what one of these is here. So let's uh, take a look. The first one here, the first one, I do know what it is because this is one of Duke's favorite movies, okay? <laughs> it's Budo from Animal House. Toga, Toga, Toga. Man, if you ain't seen Animal House, I feel bad for you, man. I really do. I feel bad. This is a fantastic movie, man. Tons of beer drinking and partying. It's it's everything you want in a movie, man. It's also funny as hell. So, Blue Doe from Animal House. He'll put this somewhere. I don't know where he's going to put any more stuff here because it's pretty loaded up. Uh, he needs to get rid of some shit. This is what he needs to do. Anyway, the next one here. Mortal... Combat. Um, it says Liu Kang on there, but uh, pretty sure that's Bruce Lee. <laughs> I mean, I've seen me lots of Bruce Lee movies. He's he's, he's a badass. Um, man, that's Bruce Lee, and they spelled his name way wrong. <laughs> you think I was bad? Uh, dang. But Bruce Lee looks pretty tough in here. You know, that's pretty cool. A little Bruce Lee figure. Um. Mark's got it written here that this completes his Mortal Kombat set, so cool, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Not really sure what that means, but uh, so here's a little information about Duke that you don't know. I like to go to yard sales. I do. I like to go to yard sales, and I picked up a couple things from Mark at a yard sale, and uh, I think he enjoyed them. So let me show you. So we got this little rhino guy figure. Um, the guy said he was from, like, Spider-Man or something. Uh, whatever, you know. Uh, Mark said it was pretty cool. Um, so, I believed him. Now, the next one here, he said was the Hobgoblin. I think I dated a chick that looked like that. <laughs> Not for real, though. For real. So, that's pretty cool, too. Uh, I do like to go to yard sales. And, you know, um, sometimes, and, and this is a little tip for everybody, sometimes I don't buy things when I go to a yard sale. And I feel bad. I do. I feel bad because I feel like I'm insulting them in some way. But, in the reality, if you think about it, you're just agreeing with those people. If you go to a yard sale and you don't buy anything, you're just agreeing with those people because they don't want that shit either. That's why they're trying to sell it to you. So don't feel bad if you go to a yard sale and, and you don't buy nothing. They don't want that crap. Neither do you. You guys are on the same page. Now, there has been times where I went to a yard sale and I had to buy something because I didn't want to make, like, a little old lady. And I didn't want her to be like, oh, your crap is crap, you know. So I went and I'll find something small, something cheap, you know. And be like, oh, that candle looks like it has a lot of life left in it. I'll go ahead and take this half-burnt candle, you know what I mean? Just something. But you don't have to do that. That's up to you, you know. Now. We are going to be doing our 700 subscriber giveaway. Uh, we are at 690. Well, that's pretty good. That's a that's 700 ish. If something costs 690 bucks, they'd be like, "Ah, eh, it's about 700 bucks." So that's that's good. That's good. Uh, excuse me. Uh, a lot of beer. A lot of beer. Now, um, what we're going to do here is we're going to give away two Funko Pops for the prize. Okay. And what you have to do to win this prize, okay, you have to go to the video 
That is linked in the description below. He told me to do this. It's down here. So, in there, there is a description to a video for a channel called JT Pops. Okay? Now, um, he collects Pops, of course, <laughs> because uh, his name is JT Pops. So it's pretty self-explanatory, I think. But anyway, so he, he here's something you got to understand is he's British, okay? So he's like from Britland or wherever it is called. Okay, so, cause I, and I know that because Mark made me watch a couple of his videos, and I noticed that he said that this Funko Pop was 20 pounds. So, I guess everything, I guess when over in Britain, the Pops are heavier over there, or maybe the gravity's different, where the Funko Pops are like, because it's like, I don't even think this is a pound. You know what I mean? And he's saying this one's 20 pounds, and this one's 15 pounds, and so, it's just a little different. So, be, be mindful of that while you're watching the video, you know what I mean? Gravity's different over there in Britain. So... You know, it can't be the same everywhere, you know, so just keep that in mind. Not a big deal. Now, in that video that's linked down below, you got to put in hashtag the nerd bar says hi. And you point, point up like that, you know. The nerd bar says hi. Okay. Watch some of the videos. Give them a like or a thumbs up. Give them a subscribe. Why not? What's it going to hurt? What's it going to hurt you? You going to feel it? You gonna feel it if you hit the subscribe button? Come on now, you ain't gonna feel shit. Come on. Um, now what are you gonna win here? You gonna win two pops, okay? First pop up is gonna be the Walmart. I know that place. Exclusive Wonder Woman Golden Armor. Hmm. She ain't dressed like she goes to Walmart. <laughs> I'll tell you that much right now. Otherwise, she'd have like a wife beater and her underwear on the outside of her pants. Uh, so, there's Wonder Woman. And then you got Prison Mac from The Office. Uh, that's weird. What office does she work at? Is there an office at the prison? Don't matter. Don't matter. Uh, so, Mark's got a note here that said, These two pops really just don't fit my collection. They're good pops. So, I thought I'd put them in a giveaway. Cool. Okay, that's great. That's great. Um, so here's what you do. Okay, you go down to the uh, video linked in the description. You put in the hashtag. The nerd bar says hi. And then on, uh, he says, next week we will do a live video and we will pick the winner. And there will be a second chance prize. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's cool. Whatever that means. So... Also, he's got it written down here. Thank you to all the support that everyone has given this channel. Uh, all 14 of you that watch these videos, thank you very much. And thank you to our Patreons. Uh, Mama J, Beard of Pop, Christopher Smith, and 6 and 6 Collectibles. Thank you very much. Uh, we appreciate that. Uh, Mark says, uh, don't forget the Patreon is up if you want to help support the channel. Um, whatever the hell that is. I don't know. Uh, sounds like some sort of wine or something. Anyway, so, that's it, man. Thanks for watching uh, Mark's videos. We appreciate that. Uh, here's your prizes you're going to get, you know, if for, for the giveaway. Uh, you're going to be helping out uh, another channel, you know. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Sorry if I offended you. I have a problem doing that. Um... Hopefully we maybe earn another subscriber or two here. So great. Thanks, man. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace up a chicken grease.